Here we go, back at it again. We got the styrofoam ceiling tiles. The one pack, it came with eight of them. I'm just doing a uh, like a powder room, my downstairs bathroom ceiling, so there's not much. I can't remember exactly the square footage, but I'll, um, I'll write it up there. All you need is this stuff called Power Grab. Get it from Lowe's, Home Depot. And you also need some caulk. I haven't caulked the, um, the seams yet, but you just put a nice little hefty coat on each piece that's gonna actually be touching the ceiling. There's one piece. I started with my, the full tiles that I could put up. It was actually, I was only able to put two full ceiling tiles before I had to start cutting. So there's the two right there. I placed that directly in the middle, got my cut, and then I just keep it moving from there. Yeah, there we go. And with those, they're the same exact measurements, so I cut one and just placed it on top of the other one and uh, marked it and cut it again so I didn't have to keep measuring it. But to get around this ceiling, the fan, exhaust fan, I had to measure it a few times, put it up there, but it came out nice and I made sure I put it further in so when I put the um, exhaust cover it would just it would click in and it would look like nothing was touched it just looks like the ceiling so I only got these four corners left and I am almost done there's one two oh, now we're down to one corner the corners were a bitch but it worked out so there we go they're all up got them all on Nice and secure, that's before. Anything was touched. Another little quick before, just so y'all can see the difference. And that is after. And also we have another after. And that is, you see how the uh, exhaust cover just fits right in there. And out of eight tiles, that's all I had left. It worked out perfect. Thank you guys for watching.